Judy from Witch Peacecraft. Welcome. It's time for our second picture in February for Shutterbug AU, my six month make along. So you'll see this on the 15th of February. I'm actually recording it quite late on the 14th of February because I have a big day at work on the 15th and I was a bit worried I wouldn't get it done. And as there is no prize draw, I can record it early. So the first picture was received well. We've had some great Ammies, some interesting colours for squares and a great baby set made by Kathleen. Um, I really like that. That was lovely. I have a few notes because I'm a little tired. Now when it comes to colours, remember, shop your stash. Near enough is good enough. As long as it's in the same colour family and close enough, use it. Don't go out and buy yarn. Um, and that's what this make along is about, having fun using your yarn stock, your yarn stash and just coming up with some great colour coordination. Um, our picture. Well, this week's picture is the first picture provided by a subscriber. Yes, I have a picture from a subscriber from Chantal in Montreal, Canada. She sent me a few pictures through that she took last year during spring, uh, murals in parks painted by people which were awesome and some other spring photos. I, with it being winter there, she's definitely missing spring and summer. I put them all into the Crochet Studio app and this one particularly caught my eye and I thought it flowed on with our make along. So are you ready to see the picture? As per usual, I'll be using my iPad because I think it's a little better for the colour. It says it's a reactive native shot image. So here we go. Now, there will be lots of different colours coming up, but this is one I particularly liked due to the colours. I'm trying to get it so you can see all the colours. No, it's not quite doing what I want it to do. Anyway, as I said, I'll put a picture at the end. And um, you can have a look. I oh, hope you can see that. There you go. There's oranges, greens, hot pinks, pinks, greys and reds. And I believe that might be a cornflower with a bee on it or some sort of bug on it. But that is awesome. I really like that. I have some other native shots that I can use. But I appreciate Chantel sending me photos and joining in and participating with our make along. Um, it's been a lot of fun so far. And yes, feel free as a subscriber if you have a great photo that you've taken and you want me to share it and use it in the, um, and give me approval to use it in the make along. I'll put it in the crochet studio app and see what sort of color palette it pulls up this one turned out really well with the oranges and the different greens and yeah it's a darker gray hot pink and a lighter pink so there you have it there are our they are our um colors sorry i'm a little vague i'm quite tired the other thing we have is we have quite a few podcasters taking part in this make along so if you could go over and check out their videos give them a thumbs up and support them we have mad mimi from crochet mad mimi's crochet and farming laura who does bod had a palooza which i love alaska alaskan crafter jan um, i call her the quiet achiever hope from hopeful crafts i'm not sure if hope's still doing videos i haven't seen any Abby from Blue Heart Crochet, she does some amazing animal groomy and she's from the UK. Lynette Charm Grammy, I was watching her video today, her live replay video on them unboxing blankets for Boggy Creek because they I think it might be today that they're going to Boggy Creek to donate their blankets. They got over a thousand donation of blankets, that is amazing. Congratulations ladies, make sure you check out Charm Grammy. Trish the Knitting Lady, I don't know if I've seen any videos lately, but she always cracks me up. And a new one that I subscribe to has joined us this year. And I've seen her in other make-alongs or 
Maybe, the, I don't know. But she has a channel and I don't think she's had it very long. Ocean View Knits and Crochet. Lorna, she's doing our make along. She has 155 subscribers, so please subscribe. Get to know her better. Remember, if you're new to the channel, welcome. You are more than welcome to join the make along. There is a participant prize draw every month. And if you participate in that particular month, you will go in the prize draw. And you have to participate for four months out of the six to go into the major prize draw at the end. But it's never too late to join Shadowbug AU. Guys, I hope you're enjoying it. My project so far, I'm on the, the bump after doing the head. And I did some um, hot pink and navy. Well, actually, it's called raspberry and navy for the head. And I did two squares. I just did, and I'm starting to sort of join as I go. I did the navy blue with a hot pink and the hot pink with a navy blue. And they were from our photos of the first colour for 1st of February. So yes, February being a shorter month, we will be back on the 1st of March with a participant prize draw for Shutterbug AU February. And hopefully we'll get some more participants jumping in and enjoying the fun. Okay, sorry I'm so tired. It's just been one of those weeks. But at least you have a photo to check out and keep moving with your projects. Until next time, stay safe. Stay well and I will see you in the next video. Bye for now.